Hey guys, I'm Bennett Monarch, and in today's video, as you can see, I'm doing a special video for you guys. Uh, I'm not sure if this is going to be Wednesday or Friday's video, but it's definitely going on the Alpha Squad channel because I'm going to be sending this to Vortex. So, no matter which channel on, please support it. This does cost me actual money. Uh, the whole reason I'm able to do this is because I bought a Destiny game, and uh, when I bought the expansion pass, they didn't give me enough money for the uh, taxes on there. So, I then had to go buy a $15 card. And I had enough money to left over to buy six advanced supply jobs, as you can see here. Now, if I do get enough support on this, I will be doing these in the future. But uh, like I said, these do cost actual money, so I will probably only do like six or something like that. But if I could get more support than what I've been getting lately, um, and get like a couple hundred views on this, then I would have enough to uh, do like a whole, whole bunch of these. But anyways, guys, as you can see here, I have six advanced supply jobs. Uh, these is stuff from earlier, so don't worry about them. Uh, this thing is ugly as fuck, but I told myself I have to keep whatever's in these advanced supply drops. I am not allowed to delete them. So that's one thing you guys will see. I have to, I will be using a lot of these weapons in future videos. But like I said guys, advanced supply drop opening. Let's get this started. Alright, we start this off with the triple professional. Uh, I hate these knee pads. Kind of upset about that. But I've never actually had these two weapons. This is my like third EMP3. The only other two I've ever gotten are both elite versions, so I'm actually kind of happy about that. And the MK14 habitually, I only have the two elite versions of that. The only I've had like one other version, but other than that, these two weapons I don't have any variants for, so it's kind of cool. Alright, sorry about that guys. I uh, got a phone call. You'll see the game cut a little bit. Uh, I had to go answer it. It was kind of an important call. Uh, but anyways, we got the MP3 Panorama, MK14 Habituate, KVA Mercenary Knee Pads. Oh, and before I forget, uh, up on the left side, I'll put it over the KVA Mercenary Knee Pads right now. I'll put the elite weapons I'm looking for. Uh, I'll list them off right now. Uh, I am looking for the SAC 3 Isolated or Royalty. Uh, that's a weapon I haven't got any elite ver variants for, even the dual wield. So it would be kind of cool to have one of those. Uh, I am looking for the MP11 Goliath. I do not have that. Uh, I am not looking for the Obsidian Steed as I'm like a couple procedures away. So if I do get it, I'll be happy. But no big deal. Uh, I don't need to work on that. But I will get the... Uh, I Well, I really hope I get the Inferno or the Royalty Bell. Because those I've been looking for for a long time. I prefer fast guns. And you guys have probably been able to tell. So... Alright, let's finish this thing up. Oh, I'm also looking for the insanity. That's the elite, thing that's losing for a while. Alright, double elite. Uh, Lagoon Exo and Whiteout Loadout. I actually don't have the Whiteout look at Loadout. I've been looking for that for a while. Let's put it on here. Alright. Oh. Gonna have to get rid of this guy. Uh, oh, actually. That's the only piece of whiteout gear other than the pants that I actually have. Alright, so I can actually do that. Alright, so let's open the last couple. Ooh, the SAC-3 Solitary. Uh, that's really cool. I, like I said, I want a SAC-3 single variant. Uh, so this is pretty cool. Yeah. Uh, not too sure about that reload animation. Uh, but this is a really cool weapon. Uh, I, like I said, I was looking for one of these. Uh, I'll definitely make a video using this. Alright. Last three. Alright. The PDW CBQB. Uh, this weapon is actually going to be retired in the next update or two, I believe. With the uh, legendary gear and everything. So I'm probably going to hold on to this just to say I have a piece of gear that they completely removed because everyone probably deletes this thing. Uh, then we got the AK-12 feeder. I've actually never had this thing. Uh, I want to take a look at it really quickly. Alright. Oh, it actually has more ammo, unlike the RIP. So that's pretty cool. Uh, never seen one of those. And then I believe we also got the... Atlas Police Shirt. Alright, that's cool. Oh, and I forgot we did got the NA-45 Agile. My first NA-40... No, second NA-45 variant. I have the Screamin'. Uh, and the a SHG Solitary Games XL. That's really cool. Uh, looks like a race car. Alright. Let's up. Elite. MP3 Bonafide. Like I said earlier, I've already got this thing. 
But, uh, I'm not too sure if I'll delete that or not. Probably won't, just as in case they ever come out with like a trading system or something like that, but... Or, like, next Double XP weekend, I'll sell that. Uh, and then we got the KF5 Endless, never had that before. I like that camel on it. Looks like a white tiger or something like that from a previous Call of Duty. And then we got, uh, I believe we got a helmet. Uh, yeah, the Alice Contract the helmet. Looks pretty cool, never had one of those. Alright, last one. Alright, I got the beanie. Uh, I actually never gotten that beanie. The Lynx Combat, my first Lynx variant. Uh, yeah, as you can tell, I got, I don't open supply, I mean supply drops that much. Um, uh, not that bad, the handling goes up so it zooms in fast like a quick scoping gun. Uh, and I believe we also got this pair of pants right here. Well guys, that's it for today's video, I hope you enjoyed, uh, I wish I could get more supply drops and stuff for you guys, but like I said, this actually costs money, so maybe when I go up in subscribers, I'll get like $100 worth or $50 worth or... Yeah, maybe $200 worth and just do a massive opening for you guys. But for right now, this is all I can afford. So, if you guys enjoyed, please leave a like down in the comment section below. Or, like down below. And then leave a comment down below as well if you would like to see this again. Just say, can we see this again? Or, uh, it doesn't really matter. But anyways guys, uh, if you also want to leave a comment about the new uh, At The Squad intro, uh, I'll have either Vortex or Razor email it to me. That way I can start including it for when I email them stuff. But please let me know what you guys think of that. I think it's great. Um, Vortex did a great job with it. I'm not sure what you guys think of it. So just let us know down below. Um, it would be really cool to get feedback on that. Because he makes all that stuff himself. He does all the editing himself. Which is really cool. Alright. Uh, I'm Minute Monarch. Hope you guys enjoy. I'll catch you guys later. Thank you.